Hi, welcome back to Entertainment Review. I'm your host, Lexi Twitty, and today I will be reviewing the movie Robin Hood. Before watching this movie, I saw that there were some pretty mixed reviews on it. That's kind of how I feel after watching the movie, sort of conflicted on whether or not it was a good movie. There were some pretty confusing points in the movie. For instance, in the beginning, Robin Hood was drafted into a war by the Sheriff of Nottingham. For some reason that wasn't really well explained, the Sheriff of Nottingham declared Robin dead while he was still fighting in the war. When Robin had returned to Nottingham, he met with an old friend that had told him that he had been presumed dead for two years. That wasn't even the craziest part. Robin had a love interest named Marion, and they were in a relationship up until the point that he was presumed dead. You'd expect that Marion would be pretty devastated to find out that the love of her life had been killed in battle. When Robin had returned to Nottingham, the first thing that he did was look for his love, Marion. When he finds her, he sees her kissing another man. We discover moments later that Marion and the other man are in a relationship. At this point, it seems as though Marion is completely over Robin and has found someone else. In only two years. Realistically, it doesn't make any sense to me. Another confusing part of the story was the costumes for the characters. Many of the characters were wearing clothing that looked like it had come straight out of this year. One example, the Sheriff of Nottingham was seen for most of the movie in a button-down shirt, a suit jacket, and dress pants. The original story of Robin Hood was said to have taken place around the year 1200 AD. Suits were not invented until about the 19th century. Now, the movie doesn't state a specific time period that the story takes place, but given the atmosphere, buildings, and gold currency, it does not seem like it takes place after the 19th century. Many things about the movie I did like, though. While it was a different Robin Hood story than most of us are used to, it still had the same steal from the rich, give to the poor motive. One of the best things about the movie was the action and fight scene. The actor that plays Robin Hood also played in the Kingsman series. The Kingsman movies had some great fight scenes, and I believe that they were one of the things that the Robin Hood movie did not lack. There were many scenes with fists flying, arrows slicing through the air, and it was overall fantastic. In conclusion, I would give this movie a 3 out of 5 stars. It was not as terrible as it was said to be. Though the plot was a bit confusing, the action and special effects made up for most of it. This has been Lexi Twitty with Entertainment Review. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.